Now we're back to learning mid journey. Let us talk about style raw. That's another parameter. Easy to understand, easy to use. There are no specific values for it. Let us make a portrait of an old man, black and white. I'll copy this prompt. So right here it's without any style. Now I use it again, I paste it and then I add minus minus style raw. Confirm. As I've said, it's the same prompt here, black and white portrait old man. While it does, we'll check the documentation and here it is explained a little bit. It can fine tune the aesthetic and in 5.2 5.1 it's minus minus style raw. Here's an example without style raw. It's more artistic you could say and style raw makes it more realistic. So this prompt is what you want to use when you for example want this realistic photography effect. Here again without and with style raw. Let's jump back. He is without style raw, could pass as realistic, but with style raw it's much more real. As I said, it's an easy parameter, you don't have to add any values or adjust any values here. But you can also access it under settings. I'm in the latest version currently, 5.2, and there's the raw mode. I start old man portrait, this time without black and white, once without raw. Now I have it checked, so it's greenish. I confirm and style raw is added the parameter automatically to my prompt because I've had it checked here. Let us compare it. Here's the one without style raw. And here's the one with. So yet again, it makes these results more realistic. Let me try a dog. Again, one without, one with, style raw. Without, we have number three, for example, is clearly artistic number one as well so you wouldn't mistake that for a real life shot and with style raw you would for example have number one which could pass as a photo easily let me go over one more example and here it becomes the most obvious i would say at least when i've tested it before i use beautiful young woman once without once with style raw And there you go, here's without style raw, very artistic, more like an illustration effect. And here the same prompt using style raw. Now we have photorealism. So use this parameter minus minus style raw. If you want to have photorealistic results, you can also read in the official documentation right here. User guide, parameters, style. I'm going to link to it. And this is all that I wanted to cover in this video. I hope it was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.